Hello everybody, welcome to another NAF ladder game. I got the Orcs out up against some Skaven here. There's the lack of tackle um, isn't ideal here, but having lots of guard is still good. I mean, block would be a bit better in this matchup, of course, on the big ones. Because you expect me making a lot of blocks. And therefore having block on your pickings would be better, but it's still good having lots of guard, it just still makes it difficult for opponents to do things. I think getting high up here is okay. a bit of a, a blob here makes it just a bit harder to get around and cut me off right I think I just have to go for the ball pickup good Woohoo! third dice gets the pal love to see it and he comes all the way back As he comes in. Alright, so that's okay. I don't mind this a lot. It's occupying a lot of space. I don't hate it. I saw Prison Architect, yeah, Jack Bull. I mean, that could be something that I liked. So could, um... So could, I've never played, uh... I've never played RimWorld, you know. I've never played RimWorld. Like, similar, isn't it? Prison Architect is definitely similar to RimWorld. Um... Problem is... Problem is... I don't really want to play... Video games. <laughs> well, hey, reward. <laughs> Blood Bowl's enough for me. And GTA when it comes out. And BG3. And Battle Brothers. And Minecraft. Hello, Sol. This is Nath Ladder. This is fine, so I like Storybook Brawl, yeah. Maybe Hearthstone, right? Maybe Hearthstone Battlegrounds. I just don't fancy that. The weird thing is, I just don't fancy Hearthstone Battlegrounds. Even though I really like Storybook Brawl. It's really weird. Yeah, exactly, Sol. Right. Okay, so we've got the YouTube cage is out in full. Full YouTube cage. Yeah, it really did, didn't it? I don't know how, but it really did. I don't know what the secret is. A storybook brawl, but it certainly did have a lot of charm. You fucking twat. <laughs> I 
and this one's kind of annoying, is it? I've just never felt the desire to play Hearthstone. It's still the right thing, I think, to blitz with a troller, you know, three dice, mighty blow. It's really good, isn't it? Like, okay, the times you lose the blitz sucks. There's an argument for just not activating and blitzing with the uh, block player. <laughs> that is pretty great, Tim. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, like if it's not if the fail, but it's it's costing me like a block, right? It's costing me a, a block, which isn't ideal. I mean, that's only one in six. And it means I was basing two players if it worked, which was pretty good. Oh, he's dodged before blitzing. All right, it didn't cost me a block. as well. Flip me. Well that sucked, didn't it? Still, there's an awful lot of card in. Oh, he's coming around. He's coming all the way around. We now have full Olivier Dulac slash Chunter mode engaged. Yeah, this is pretty good. So I don't know why you uh, don't like this. There's, uh Right, it's it's gone pretty well for him. Zero harm. I mean, okay, it sucks that all these all these line rats can't do anything because of guard. But I'm assured that uh, might go tackle is better, so you know. Who can say? <laughs> oh, I mean, the troll's got mighty blow, hasn't he? So, so. So that's my single mighty blow. Just roll all the three pluses. Pretty effective. Jokes on him and I just get the 3D instead. For a massive push. Oh boy. <laughs> he won't know what to do after that.
Let's beat him off. Very base cage, isn't it? But I mean, it's a bunch of dice for him to do stuff with it. So I don't hate it too much. Maybe I showed up how it's pretty decent from here, isn't it? Not too good. Just roll a three plus, mate. Four guard Norse. Did you, uh, did you do what I said, Dimmy, and watch all of Elliot's games and all of Chagan's games? Or not? Gets the full pal. But do they take four guard? Oh my god, full power. That's outrageous, isn't it? So now he's got a 1D on the ball. What a joke. What an absolute joke. I mean, maybe I shouldn't have just trusted in strength four players to hold that front bit, but. Because it really wasn't that hard, was it? It wasn't hard at all to get this 1D on the ball. Oh dear, oh dear. That was completely irrelevant, wasn't it? Oh wait, no, he's doing something different. Oh god, what is this? I mean, okay, yeah, it's another player knocked over, but it's still just a 1D on the ball. Flip me. Why not? Why not so? Dice don't fail. Well, hey, there we go. We've got the ball and a block player now. Who's movement six? That's much better. See, it was all a cunning plan by myself to get my ball sacked. No problem. Not even one of the guard ones. Right. I'm definitely just going to 3D him. Good. Should have stood him up first, eh? These two both block off. So the blitz has to come in there. I need another player here. He could block and fall. No, he can't reach. He could go there to make this a 3D. That isn't terrible, is it? To make that a 3D. I mean, this has to be the blitz. <laughs> mhm. Mm <laughs> Pretty annoying. <laughs> you can just 2D him, then he can't 2D him very well, so it's not too bad. I, I guess I don't want him to go stupid now, so he has to not block. Me back here. Good, punchy, punchy. Yeah, I think not blocking here is better. If it goes stupid, then he's got a 2D on him. 
and then like an uphill on him and then a hit on the back, it's not too bad is it, what if I punch him then I clear somebody maybe I can punch him, and I've got mighty blow haven't I to power him could just push him away Injured, mighty blow, there you go, good. There's nine as well. Mighty blow turns out good skill. Yeah, he went, he went full chunts slash livid lad, didn't he? Got three players stunned, one player cast. Not bad. Not bad. Bless the heavens. <laughs> Turn five, make a removal versus Skaven. <laughs> oh. Now he's got to think about the one turn, I guess. Does he reroll this? <laughs> oh. He has to, yeah, he has to leave that. Um, right, so of course we have to move up first. As safely as possible. Which means probably just moving the troll. As annoying as that is. But at least now that I know it, I know that it can't move me. Just block him and don't follow. A blockless block. I can go down to one reroll and even pushing him lets me move two big ones around. Probably got to reroll that, I guess. Basically, these two would be good, wouldn't it? Nah, I'm not really, not really basing him. Uh, sorry, basing him here. I'm not really basing him because he can just roll anyway. Uh, standing there is a really good place to stand. It actually is, isn't it? Because it's keeping him from going around the back. But if I blitz him, then I'm standing there, which is okay. Here, can't I? Then, then two players punch him, which is good enough for me. Does he punch him now? We're both downs okay. <laughs> a few, so a few. Not not that many to be fair, I didn't like. It, he hit he, he he took most of the blocks of the turn where I made a bunch of stuns and a cast to be fair. To be fair Before that I wasn't too aggressive in basing him up because it was quite a deep kick, so you know I'd like I'd taken a couple of turns just to move up. Oh, I'm just 
just three pluses away. So much for that plan and that big one. This big one might dodge next turn. To relevancy. Dodge to relevancy is alright, isn't it? Uses his last reroll, okay, good. So there's like no one turn, no one turn chance realistically. Oh, well. Certainly not a good one turn chance. Obviously, not no chance, but it's not a good one turn chance for him, is it? Yeah, this is a real, this is a real school of chunter kind of player, isn't it? For sure. For sure, we've got ourselves, we've got ourselves a, a chunter style player. Everything based all the time. Okay, that's actually great. Not following there, that just stands up here and gives us a 3D. That's nice. This guy gets to come in here. Do you want to try any kind of surfs? I probably shouldn't, should I? I don't really know how to get up the field safely though, which is a concern. I think I just need a pal here, honestly, on the three dice. Good. Good. Another pal, good. Dodge, what? Oh, I haven't punched him yet. <laughs> I have not punched him yet. Right. I need a dodge with this guy, I think. Uh, not a GFI with this guy first. Because if I push him, he'll be based. So I have to do this GFI first. Flip me. Four, five, six, yeah, I've got to stand this guy. I should have stood him first anyway. Hello. Bit dicey though, isn't it? I mean, you can you can at least uphill. And it's would have rather not use my last reroll on that GFI. That surfs, yeah. Oh, fun fuck. Um, yeah, that was. I mean, I had to surf him, didn't I? It was just it was just literally the best way to progress up the field. There was no doubt that that was the correct correct play. Did I even roll a power with the uh, with the Mister Throw? Maybe I should have taken a power if I'd rolled it. I don't know. I think it was correct to do the GFI first as much as it sucked. He is out of rerolls now though, so anything can fail at this point in time. I've got an auto 
the score, don't I? I don't even have to look. As much as I would love to take all of these blocks first. Oh hey. There's a real argument for a 3D with block, isn't there? But um, I just can't. I could 3D without block to make this a 3D with block. But I think just score. Oops. Incitement. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should stop this. Maybe, because this is one of the things where, like, you know, like the. Oh, I should have vomited. I should have vomited, blitzed. Oh, you're so right. Oh, no. Um, the thing, the thing about this is, like, you know, the BLGF. Some people didn't realize that was a joke. And this just might piss people off. So I guess I'm going to stop doing it. Yeah, not vomiting was... Oh, garbage. I'm the worst. The absolute worst. Should be ashamed of myself. All the rest of it. He's got a sidestepper, so... I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how good he is at 110s. He's got no reroll though, so I've got that going for me. <laughs> exactly, Willie Goblin. Yeah, you know, you just don't know what people think. You might, you might just think I'm an absolute asshole doing this. You can 3D all the way. He hasn't got a rat auger, you know, so. I think you're wrong. <laughs> okay, well, the answer is no to that. Yeah, 2D, that's what I'm saying, because I've got guard here. I've got guard here, so... Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you have to 3 plus dodge into here, doesn't he? You have to 3 plus dodge into here. And then blitz him, and then push him back into there. And then block him there, up to there. But yeah, I guess the I guess the big one should have been here to stop three Ds. Mm. Or maybe even like the troll, right? Strength five. Maybe that's where the troll should have been. Yeah, that's where the troll should have been. Well, the thing is, I'll be honest. I'll be honest. Well, he didn't have a reroll, right? He just got it off the kick, I guess. Um, I didn't think he was K Fog level one turn. But he could have been, right? He could have been. Because, you know, there's the, the YouTubers there. So, you, you know, people, people could be. People could have watched the K Fog one turners and could be incredible at it. But. That's pretty advanced to, to go for that, I would say. Uh, 
How did people cheat in... People did not cheat in Super League, uh, Willy Goblin. People cheated on Ladder, which has nothing to do with Super League. It was completely unrelated to cheating, and it honestly, I mean, wow, it is what it is. It is what it is. I can put I can put big men on the LOS, can't I? Oh, who did? Was this monitor or somebody? Not monitor. Sorry, diamond. Was this diamond? Somebody did this. Somebody did like this as their is their defense. I think it was Diamond, but I think it was like with fleshes and stuff. <laughs> like it's pretty good, isn't it? It's like what do you do against this? Like if you've got a rattle grove, obviously you surf a guy. But if you've got fleshies or, or rates, they can't even surf. We'll see. We'll see what happens. That was Hello Diamond. <laughs> um, yeah, I saw it and I was like, okay, this is pretty good, isn't it? Um, maybe I've, I should have put more guard on the on the line here because you can roll up the up the line a little bit, maybe. But um, yeah, pretty strong. Yeah, it was it was it was collusion in. Uh, maybe I should put the. Uh, maybe I should, uh, I should. I should put that in the YouTube thing. It seems like people might not know about it. Hello, everybody. Ah. The golden can. It was lovely here in Kailan again, isn't it? So he's gonna duck her. Oh man. Oh man. Having to defend against a Daka for the first time in ages. What the hell? Is the defense a straight line? I mean, it's fucking gonna be.
Abandoning the troll, always a great idea. <laughs> the problem is, if I put somebody next to him, then all of a sudden, uh, these should have just been one back, right? These should have just been one back. Oh, dear. Anything last night? Uh, oh, well, yeah, that was yeah, that was your game, wasn't it? Versus the chaos, the yeah, straight line, yeah. Maybe straight line's okay, but you should—you've just got to like you've just got to you just had to break through over like two or three turns, right? That's what you have to do. So if you don't do that, then you're going to end up not being able to break through. But that was what you had to look for, Keith. How you how you should have gone through over multiple turns. And like the timing of it rather than what the actual best play was once everything else had gone wrong <laughs> basically good It feels like that because he really wants to long bomb this guy, doesn't he? I could uh, move the Mr. Throw up and then Blitz and then replace him with a Blitzer. Could just stay where I am, but then obviously it's not, not doing anything. I could try and move him. Easy. Because I want to blitz somebody and uh, cast them to me. That's dumb. Like they're trying to avoid damage, aren't they? So if you just wait at the OS, then, then you're saving them damage. And if they go through, then you've just let them, you just let them waste time, not take damage, not make any decisions. They roll some dice and they're through, and then you're like, oh. It's hard, like it's hard to defend the dagger. There's no just like easy thing to do, unfortunately. Like, I feel like you want to pressure it, right? Because you want to break AVs, you want to hurt their players, but then... You know, you risk the breakthrough. But, you know, if you risk the breakthrough down here, at least... Like, if they fail, you just score on them, don't you? Whereas if you're at midfield, then they burn all of their turns automatically. And uh, that's not good either. 
Who knows? Who knows what the right answer? I like. I literally don't know what the right answer is for the attacker. That's the funny thing. I don't think anybody's played with it or against it enough. That's what I think. They still break through just as far, though, right, Tora? And then that that you're letting them burn the turns in front of you instead of burning the turns behind you. So you're just making it easier anyway, right? I mean, they're always going to have an uphill blitz, aren't they? Like, there's no, there's no way you can stop them having an uphill blitz, unfortunately. Okay, well, good. Does he block? No, he ha he has to block. the pitch. Shit. Okay. Not great. Maybe I should have tried a... Uh Maybe I should have tried to hit diagonal. This guy could have just stopped there and this guy could have come in and I could have blitzed diagonal and it wouldn't have gone out. Maybe I should have done that. For GFI here, I'm basing him, which is something, isn't it? I'm also stopping him getting assists. He can double GFI to there, and then he can go behind him, and then he can go for the double GFI pickup. Then that makes this uphill already really good. Do I just try and stand? I don't want to just stand on it. Good. It's not bad, is it? Not bad. The problem with like bullying like that though is that it leaves them a way out, doesn't it? In a way, I don't know. I like just staying off a little bit. I was gonna slam in the next turn. Yeah, the troll was too slow, wasn't it? The problem is the troll was too slow. So the troll literally couldn't get in that turn. So if if the troll had been movement five, then everything would have gone in. But I didn't want to not go in with the troll. And with other things, that was the problem there. Maybe, maybe these big should have just gone forward there. I don't know. Oh, thank you. Good. 
<laughs> good. So he can go there and I can just block the mighty blow guy. And then I can blitz the gutter. That seems good. Blitz the gutter first. That was incorrect, wasn't it? Because I could have just based here first. Oh fuck, I've got to re-roll this. Jesus. Just go forward and base both of these. And punch him. Punch him. Do you know what I need to do? I need to set up a game like uh, Orcs versus Wood Elves <laughs> with somebody where we play a best of a best of a hundred <laughs> where we both have to dacker both times. <laughs> yeah. Just the elf half, right? Just do half a game. Just do a half a game. Oh my god, he's just going to do all of this. What the hell? We'll just do a three three two two and then uh and now he's got a four three two D. Okay, but fail the four three, okay, good. Flip me. I guess there's no need for him to not just be standing. These punch like the problem is the one in nine's terrible, right? Or the dub skull's terrible. And okay, you gain things by punching them, but not enough. Yeah? Oh nice! Elliot is up for it. Amazing. Yeah, because I, I was thinking Elliot. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was so excited! I was literally so excited! Because nobody else has like, well, I don't think anybody has like dackered that much, right? And played against a dacker that much. 
when you think about it. Um, so, how about I send you some pistachio nuts <laughs> and then we can talk about it. <laughs> um, but, you know, like, so... I could, like, make some, you know, YouTube videos of them and stuff, like the Dakar and that. Oh, my... Oh, my God, what is this? Okay, good, it wasn't the ball. Jesus. There's been some scary things happening. I've got to say, there's been dice rolled on... on and this in this game, but luckily nothing earth shattering yet. Um, so yeah, so the idea would be right. You make an orc team and an wood elf team, and I make an orc team and a wood elf team. Probably not NAF style, but maybe NAF style, but maybe just like you know a random team of this is a team, and then um, after making said teams we like play a half and then you know just a half just defend just because then we're, we're dackering and defending against a dacker don't we so we just play one half um and then start again so it's just like just practice dackers you know one of us will dacker one of us will defend one of us will dacker one of us will defend and then just do that as actual practice you know like what actual games people do <laughs> oh that was a bad move from him wasn't it it is fucking effort yeah yeah, yeah. okay well let, let's do this punch first and it is the power which makes it harder for us. Amazing. <sighs> so now to blitz on him and a block with him. If I just got a push there, it would have been a really easy uh, clear. A blockless block. I'm not going to GFI, obviously. I don't know, I, I quite like Diomed's one of just a big long line. I did like that defence because it just, you know, well, it almost forces the Daka, right? Because it, it just, it 100% denies the LOS. So that, like, his setup almost forces the Daka. Like, I guess that's what his setup does, right? It completely, yeah, yeah, he just, <laughs> he had, like, fleshies or wraiths somehow, but yeah, just seven on the LOS, two, one square back. And, uh,. Yeah. No, 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 no. It doesn't. No, nothing, nothing. Mate. It just basically falls you attack, doesn't it? It makes it. Um, do you think it makes it better? I don't know about that, but I think it makes it. Uh, it makes it so that, like, obviously, a conventional drive is basically impossible because you just can't make hits on the But I mean, is the blitz weaker? Can you uh can you not move things on the LOS on a blitz? Um, so you've got four players for a blitz, right? Well, oh yeah, because yeah, you put you put your three on and base everybody. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah okay, fair enough. 
Errata, errata. Alright, so I just 2D him and then score. Can I 3D him? No. Can I safe move first? Oh. Yes. No, I'm just I'm not going to do it anymore. I'm not going to do it anymore. I'm not going to do it anymore. Because people, people will get the wrong idea. I'm not toxic. I know that's not toxic, but... Fucking... I don't think it's toxic, but some people will want me, so fuck it. Just... I guess he could one turn and then get a riot, but um, it's unlikely. Well, I, mean, I don't think it's any nicer. I think it's just a bit of a fun, but yeah, I guess. That's, uh, I love Seven Guard Fury. I absolutely love it. I absolutely love, love the Seven Guard. <laughs> yeah, maybe just do it like to Dimmy and Sea Bros and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because Papa Vicio, um Cyanide are not the best at making video games. <laughs> yeah. Uh, perfect friends. No, no, no. Yeah, no, I won't do it versus, versus anybody except like Dimmy. Oh yes, <laughs> this isn't a joke this time, right, Elliot? Because you've made me, you've made me the happiest man in the about a hundred square foot of Darlington. <laughs> oh, hey, did you send the turn? Yeah. If. Yeah, the colour, it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's got problems as, from, as Blood Bowl 3. I fully renounce all TD dancing and emoting. I hereby declare all, the, wow, Elliot, oh my god, Elliot, that is, even versus Dimmy? Even versus Dimmy, Elliot? <laughs> Man, you drive a hard bargain. Even versus Dimmy? You know that I'll do it by accident afterwards. Even if I even if I say it and mean it, you know I'll do it accidentally. Like I could, I could, I I won't I won't um I would definitely could not emote ever again. Uh that's easy. But the dance I will just do accidentally, hundred percent guaranteed. I will, I will. I won't. It won't I won't me. I'll. I'll just forget that I prom made the promise. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> like the the emoting I'm doing on purpose because C Bros was doing it for fun, and then I was doing it for fun. But the TD dancing is too ingrained into my personality. Well, there you go. Anyway, um, thank you very much, Bartolo, for the game. Um, GG. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like. And don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I don't know why I went into that accent. And stay fantastic. <laughs>